Today, we're gonna to take a look at the ROG Strix X570i Gaming Motherboard BIOS settings for CTR. Now that we're into the BIOS, let's go to the Precision Boost Override. Yeah, I overshot it. Uh, what we want to do is make sure these two are on auto. They're all on auto, so we really don't have to worry about which one's on auto. Your core voltage is right here, and that's on auto. Very good. CPU multiplier. Now, this is right up here, I believe, to be the frequency. And so I have that on auto. Okay, now what we want to take a look at is the CPPC. And so let's go over to the advanced tab. We're going to go all the way down. I believe it's the CBS and then down to the MBIO. And then we have to go down to SMU common options. Uh, there we are right here. As you can see, I've already enabled those. So let's go back and we're going to look for the global C state, which I think is right on this page. Where is that global C state? One more back, I believe. Yep, there we go. There's your global C state control. As you can see, I have that enabled as well. And your power profile is irrelevant. There you go. There are the settings for the ROG Strix X570i gaming motherboard. That motherboard is an ITX motherboard, so please do not get it mixed up with anything else. If you like this video, please hit that like button. If you have any comments or questions, please put those in the comments area, and I will be put in, in the description where you can find all those different settings. And this is Chris saying out.